The DIY Watch Club is such a fun way to learn about watch making and watch modding. Previously here on the channel, I've put together two of their dress watches. One of them, I even heat treated my own hands. If you're interested in watching that video, that was a fun one. You can find it right here. Well, one thing I like about the DIY Watch Club is that they don't stay stagnant and just keep putting out the same old watches that they've done in the past, but they keep innovating and they keep producing new models that you can try your hand at. And that's what we have in today's video. We are putting together a GMT watch that is using that new Seiko NH34 movement. In this video, I'm not going to go into all the detail of how I put the watch together, but I will say that all together, it took me about a couple hours and it's always a fun experience. The video instructions on their website make the process clear and easy to follow. You just need a little patience and a steady hand to put it all together. I think the finished product came out great, so we're gonna take a closer look at it, go over all the specs and features, and really see if this might be a watch you wanna try and put together yourself. To start, I'll mention that there is a discount link in the description that will give you 5% off your purchase of any DIY Watch Club kit. That is an affiliate link, so if you choose to use it, it also helps out the channel and we always appreciate it. This particular GMT model retails for 490 US dollars, but don't let that price scare you. They're always running sales on their website so you can find it there for much cheaper. The model I have is their Coke bezel model, but they also have a Pepsi version and one with a white dial and stainless steel bezel that looks great and it's very reminiscent of you know what. Hello there. The dimensions here are a 41 millimeter case diameter, 42 at the bezel, a case thickness of 14 millimeters, a lug to lug distance of 47.6 millimeters, and a lug opening of 22 millimeters. The case finishing is quite nice with brushing on the sides and tops of the lugs and a polished chamfered edge as well. The case back is open and screwed down. The crown is also screwed down and this watch features 200 meters water resistance. The bezel is 120 click, unidirectional, and features a ceramic insert with fully luminous 24 hour markings. The loom on the entire watch is well done and I like how they've done the GMT hand in a different color. There is a matte black sandwich dial here which I like a lot. The minute, hour, and second hands are polished in their finish, and the GMT hand is a nice bright red. If you're interested in how to use a GMT watch like this one from DIY, they have a good video that you can check out in the card above. On my 6.5 inch wrist, the watch wears well and is very comfortable, particularly due to the FKM rubber strap it comes with. If you're not familiar with FKM as a material, it's awesome and you should check out my video where I talk all about it. All right guys, so let me know what you think of this Coke bezel GMT watch from the DIY Watch Club. Share all your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. Please take advantage of the discount that I have with my affiliate link if you're interested in this watch or other watches from the DIY Watch Club, that link is in the description. And please hit the like button on this video. We really appreciate it, it really helps out. But that's it for today here on The Town Watch. Thank you so much for stopping by. We'll see you next time.